Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be playing a game called Speedrunner on Roblox. This game is basically like a uh, Tower of Hell, but with like Speedrun 4 added to it. And it controls so sat it's like so satisfying to play. And you guys probably can just watch this and like eat popcorn. Like literally this that's how like Sometimes I just play this game not to actually get wins or anything, but just to like watch it. It's just, it's like act kind of addicting, but not for the fact to like get to finish it. Well, also that, but you know. This game is just that, like. Not. So it's, when, when you look, when you, if you're trying to play this game, it's called Speed Runner which immediately seems like it's some sort of like clone, just bad knockoff game. It's not a clone, although I could have, they could have came up with something more creative. But, uh, also I don't know why these jump pads aren't working, it's kind of annoying me. Um, this game still needs work. And that's basically every game, so basically it's fine. It's a great game, quiet. If you're, if you're into speedrunning games like me, like, if you like, if you know what speedrun reload, reloaded is, you know what this, you should play this. Or even if you just saw my video and went to play it, which, if there's very low chance, that video doesn't have an incredible amount. It's not my most viewed video, so. Also guys, can we like get my most viewed video to be one with just me? Like I know that's kind of rude to, to uh, Alec plays, you know? Cause my most viewed video is with him on playing things and people. This does not make me mad in any way. And he gets a promotion, which is probably the most triggering part about it. But luckily, no one's actually going to his channel, which, here Alec, I'll do you a favor. If you guys don't know who he is, go watch like my Fling Things and People video or Speed Run Reloaded. And in the card, if you have, um, if you're on PC, there'll be a card at the top that has a, like a little, it's white. You probably know what it is. It just says something. It says like, I believe like my friend's channel. Oh, basically, what? Why did it take me back to the beginning? That was weird. I guess now we have to literally like go crazy. Uh, okay, that's a bug. <laughs> I thought I died there. Yeah. I don't know if you guys noticed, but they actually added their own animation for when you jump, which is pretty epic. And for some reason, sometimes, as you guys just saw, the checkpoints glitch out and you have to go back to the beginning. That has not happened to me. Uh, only now that I'm recording this video, which is pretty crazy. But, okay, so like I was saying, uh, that, my, Alec plays his channel, if you don't know how to, if, cause since he's not, he's about, only a few, he's, uh, not much more popular than I am, he, uh, he also has, you can find, it's probably, you, it's probably gonna be hard for you to actually search up his, uh, channel, um, so, I recommend you just go see the speedrun reloaded video and just find the card. Oh, these jumps are hard. And I'm not the best at these at this game. I have four wins, which is like nowhere near as good as some of the other kids. Yep, 
kids. They sound not all kids. What am I saying? I'm like acting like I'm playing. Don't like me out to get down, get down. No, I'm not cringy. I don't play that game, please. Oh. Oh. What? Oh, time's up. I was like, why did I just kill me? I hope you guys hear my amazing Razer keyboard that is actually really nice. It's just loud. <laughs> So like clicky. What was I supposed? Oh, I bet you there was one of those jumper thingies. So in this game, there are some special things that you won't see in any other games, like those. Look, this, that little bounce I just did. Yeah, that's um. That's actually. That's like. They made these own little like bounce pad things. Some of them you can just run through and they bounce into the next part of the level. And some of them you have to time your jump. And basically every time that you play, the levels are randomly generated, which makes this pretty, pretty cool. Um, I will say though, that um the world generation once you play it for a while you're gonna notice that's the same few different types of levels like different parts mashed together randomly which is okay it doesn't affect me that much um it's just you're gonna notice like so one, it's just gonna like say like this part, the red is probably you could probably see it in another uh, like at another time, like another run. Um, it'd be a different color and a different part of the stage. Basically, there's no like actual difficulty tuning, and the platforms aren't random or anything like that. Which now that I say that, that that just sounds like it's like some sort of like masterpiece, which that is not made on Roblox. So, yeah. Enough blibber blabbering about this game. It's basically what you'd expect, but a little better. If I had to explain it to someone, like say, have, like give it a reading and just say, what you'd expect, slightly more, like you can tell they spent time on it. Also, so, as you guys saw, these little jump things, you can't jump on them, you have to run up to them. You don't actually jump, so you don't press space, you just kind of like, W it. Also, is it not clear, Roblox, that I pressed the space bar there? You guys can probably turn up your volume loud enough to hear that I, like, just spam. We have five minutes. I haven't played this in a while. That's why if I if I had played this more, uh, the footage would be more satisfying. But if you play this like at least like three rounds, suddenly you just get like addicted to getting first. And let me continue to jump over platforms and make a full auto. That's literally what I do. Okay, we're almost done with green. Okay, these scare me. These literally scare me. Uh, okay, moving on to blue. This should not be that hard whatsoever. Okay, I'm pulling off the most poggest moves ever. If poggest is even a word. Poggiest, maybe? Not sure. Alright, we're on yellow now. Okay, that was cool. Oh! These are probably the most time-consuming things I've ever seen. Those things we just passed through. You can't sprint through those. That- how much does that trigger you? A lot. Okay. Oh no. 
almost out of time. Because every time someone finishes, you you have less time to do it. Uh, like the time goes by faster, so you'll see times 1.5. It basically makes the time go by faster every time someone finishes. I think it's like, it adds point, it goes by 0.5 seconds faster every time someone finishes. And like we are about to, if we just flawless these guys, which I clearly didn't do. No, imagine it took me back to the beginning. I would literally just end the video and smash my finger. Okay, maybe my parents won't be happy about that. Neither would you guys, because I wouldn't be able to upload videos. Or at least I would. Oh, you would be disappointed because. Okay, moving on. <laughs> We're almost done. We're almost done. I don't want to jinx myself, but I probably will. Ah. Uh, Whee! What? We just won. Time to let's see if anyone else finishes. I just see someone failing right there. Oh, someone might make it here. Come. Oh yes, yes, this guy right here. You see the little marble? He's like a little pipsqueak. Yeah, boy. There's a lot of people reaching the end. Come on. Guys, you can do it. Yes, we have another bait. We have a bacon hair in the house. I think we'll play. So, that will pretty much wrap up today's video, guys, and I will see you guys next time. Peace!